Hey everyone, this is Char from Char's Fashion Nation. And just when I'm getting ready to set up for today's video, and this will be part of today's video, um, I'm going to walk you over to that wall we talked about last night. Okay, check this out. So it's like I'm doing a prayer in here, a blessing. And what shows up on the wall, like, like, are you serious? I don't know if you guys can see that, but are you serious? I'll try to get a better view. Hold on. I'll try to get a better view for you, but are you serious? I don't know what that is, and it's coming from, that's never been in here before. I don't smoke. Nobody's allowed to smoke in the house. Are you serious? Whatever that is, I don't know how well you guys can see it, but whatever it is, is coming down the wall. Oh, hold on, let me move Manny. And if you see Manny moving, whatever that is, maybe that's what's been moving Manny. Hold on. Okay, like right up on the wall. Right here. Is where I'm seeing whatever this is dripping down the wall. Oh, this is from the blind over there, but whatever this is, is physically dripping down the wall. What it is, I don't know. It's never been there before. Now, maybe you can see it a little better. Yeah, there you go. Now you can see it. That, my friend is creep. Now I'm not doing this to boost my numbers. Don't get me wrong. I'm not doing this to boost my numbers. I just noticed this on my wall. Like what in the world is this on my wall? It doesn't smell like dragon's blood, which is a plant extract to keep away negative energy. Um, much like holy water, it's a plant extract to keep away negative energy when you do a uh, positive energy prayer to keep you safe. Um, so it's very much like using holy water. Now, I have already dosed Manny with some a week ago. So hold on, we're gonna sit down. Okay, but tell me that that is not freaky weird. Excuse me. Um, and not only is it freaky weird, but on the same day that I find that YouTube put the odd amount of numbers as my watch, or as my views, I should say, as my views. Like, really? What are they doing? And what time did they do that? So, first of all, let's get into this. I'm going to go ahead and just brush out my hair because my hair has been all, like, frizzed city all day. And I don't know what's up with that. Maybe it's just the weather. Because my hair gets poopier when it gets closer to winter. So we'll just brush that out real quick. And sometimes I'll spray my hair to tame it. The same thing I use on my face. So um, what I was going to tell you guys also. That um, a little something that I wanted you guys to look for. Was the odd movements from my haunted objects. In my room 
And what I'm going to do separately is go through my videos and count how many times something strange has happened, whether it be EVP, Manny Quinn moving, sick call box moving, or the haunted chair, or maybe you hearing an odd voice coming over the video, other than the EVPs that I told you about. It, those EVPs do not count. No, those EVPs do not count. Um, not the EVPs that I brought to you. Those do not count. So uh, I will go and uh, count a number of odd things. Oh, yep. I know another odd thing, but you have to go look for it. Um, it's kind of like an Easter egg hunt on my channel. But it's a trick and treat. <laughs> I'm trying to trick you. Not trick you. I'm trying to treat you. It's kind of like trick or treat. Um, Halloween. You know, since this is um, October, I'm just going to go ahead and just clip my hair back away from my face. You know, I feel like Jeffree Star clipping his hair back away from his face just to do his makeup. I may double clip the other side. I have so much more hair on one side of my head. This is normal anyway. Like, one side of our facial frequency is actually bigger than the other side, but people think that's weird, but it's just human physics. So we're going to get into this makeup. And what I'm going to do today is try to do an assorted, oh, and look what I found. My Elf Cosmetics show jacked up. Is that not weird? I find that to be weird because, like, I'm doing this and then it shows up, like, the next day. <laughs> right. I'm sure you agree with me on that one. And if you don't, there's something wrong. <laughs> because it's kind of weird. I know I said I would have this part done, but like, oh my gosh, I was going to go ahead and do this part, but you know what, guys? Like, I'm just going to go ahead and do this. Then I'll be back with my foundation on, and then we'll do the rest. So I'll be right back with that part. Okay, but well you guys may be wondering, I said earlier that I was going to do um, a Wonder Woman look. But you know what? Um, I was thinking, you know, Lillian Munster never gets enough recognition, right? Lillian Munster. Oh my gosh. My favorite growing up was the Munsters. <laughs> absolutely adored the monsters. In fact, Butch Patrick is on my friend on social media, on Facebook, um, only because I know his guitar teacher and we've actually met in person. And he has such a beautiful wife. Um, and I did do a monsters family uh, portrait for Butch and like so um, today I'm actually going to do a tribute to Lillian Munster my favorite now here's something where you guys know I said some of the cosmetics from last year that I used disappear well this is the only one that showed up my brushes are still missing so we'll do Lillian Munster's eyebrow. That's why I blocked my brow. She just had such a beautiful eyebrow. I mean, our eyebrows are similar, but she has such a 
beautiful breath. Oh, she, may she rest in peace. Great actress. She did so many roles. She did character acting so well. And maybe that's why I'm wearing kind of a gray tone today. Maybe it was meant to be. Maybe it was just meant to be. Okay. So, um, that was weird to find on the wall. Pretty sure you all agree with me on that. That was weird. Um, <laughs> Barry. And I'm going to go ahead and use that white tone on my eye. Because you know, Lily and Munster didn't have a lot, a whole lot of color on her eyes. So it was basically blocked in color on her eyes. And um, I love how they did her makeup. Just adored it because it was just, it was beautiful by itself. She, her character was just very classy. But I still want to know, how do you get a werewolf from a vampire and a Frankenstein? But, oh, hey, Herman was made up from other parts. So who knows where that part came from, right? That's the werewolf. It was taken from a, a werewolf, I guess. Because if you ever notice, little Eddie Munster wasn't exactly a vampire. He was actually a werewolf. Vampire mix, so. Even though he was a true monster. He was mixed between vampires. Because his dad's body parts came from different people. And if you want to know, Grandpa Munster is the one that helped put Herman together. <laughs> Which makes it even funnier. And that does, that makes that even funnier. <laughs> so, I'm going to go ahead and use that Believe Cosmetic again today. And I will blend this with some of the other cosmetics that I do have. As you guys know, she did wear a lot of purple. That was just her natural dead look. Not that she was dying to just go there, but that was just her natural look. Like I said, you could take any of these looks that I'm doing and do them for any. I mean, you don't have to do it for a costume. Unless, of course, you're going to a cosplay. Then yes, absolutely for a cosplay. This would work great for a cosplay. I normally just do this during Halloween. Not that I'm dying to always look this way, but. <laughs> Do you know, she always had that smoky eye. I was loving that girl. She had that smoky Graceful, smoky eye. 
And then we're going to take a little bit of that shimmery gray. And get it here because that's actually where it was. It's in the crease. I had that shimmery gray right here in the crease. And don't worry, I'll do the cheeks. She did have a rather gray cheek. In fact, her face was gray. Kind of a really light ash gray. But it was still pretty. And that is why I used like my lighter tone so that I could get the makeup to stick. And I will line my eyes. But you guys notice I didn't do that part before putting on anything else. I did not do that um, because it just didn't need it yet. And she, like myself, actually does have the high cheekbone, except for hers are more sunken. Maybe that's why she played the role of a Native American once. Um, because uh, she actually did do the role of a Native American in a movie. Okay, so like here's the deal. You guys already know Manny Quinn does move. Something weird is on the wall because we just covered that, right? Like, <laughs> not we just covered that, it's covering my darn wall. Whatever the heck it is, it's never been there before. Rest of the light gray around my face just to kind of wash the look in. Because that's what we're going for here. We're going for that more Lillian Munster gracious look. Oh, she had such beautiful skin. I, that's one thing I always liked about that character. Is they never made her look ugly. They always gave her this graceful look. I don't know if you guys ever noticed that. She always had this graceful look about her. Even though she was ashy, dead, she was very graceful. And that's one thing I've always loved about always loved about that with her character. I don't know if I can pop that on there. I have my mirror over here so I can always check with my mirror. So let me finish this part and then I'll come back and finish the rest. But um and then we'll talk about the other parts that I want you guys to look for. Okay, so we're back with, I didn't put eyeliner on. I don't feel that I needed to, so I just basically uh, brushed on some uh, eyeshadow around the black eyeshadow. So, sorry, I really want to keep Manny focused here. I really do, in case she moves. So, so in case she moves, you guys can actually catch that. So like I was saying, um, things I want you guys to actually look for in my other videos, and I'm not trying to catch you guys into boosting my rating for YouTube, it's just that I've noticed a lot of strain 
in my videos lately. Pop some light in there. I'm not dreading the dead. Let it, let it uh, look that way on my face. So we'll take a little bit of the wet and wild. We don't want to look too alive here, but just enough sparkle. To liven things up a little bit. There we go. Just enough dead. Um, to liven things up, right? That's a funny way to put it. Just enough dead to liven things up. Now, I... I haven't uh, did they use this one yesterday? I don't think I did. I think I used my own color. Anyway, um, she didn't have a red lip. Anybody thought she had a red lip? She actually did not have a red lip. Oh, oh my gosh, have to break that to you. She actually did not have a red lip. Where did my lip stick? Oh, there it is. She actually had a darker mob. Tone to her lip. And since this is a buildable lip color, I'm not too worried about that. Remember, Mooley Munster is supposed to look dead. And like I said, she was my favorite. If I had to pick between the Adams Family and the Monsters, I'm sorry, I have to go for the Monsters. Why? Because, um, because I find, I found them to be much more humorous. Much more humorous. I am going to go ahead and put the much more humorous than the Adams family. Um. And maybe that's because, I don't know, I just found them to be much more humorous. If that's just me, everybody has their choices on who they like best out of what old TV series. Did you guys know I did Dark Shadows last year? Um, which was fun to do. I'm going to go ahead and let this down. Because Lillian always, for a majority... For a majority of the time, Lillian always wore her hair down. Now, everybody tells me I look like Morticia, and I can't help that. But this is a tribute to Lillian, not Morticia. So we're doing Lillian's hair today, which is, guess what? Parted in the middle, not on the side. Morticia has hers on the side. Lillian has hers parted in the middle. If you never noticed that, you should go look. Um, and like I said, if you notice anything weird in here moving, or if you hear any strange EVPs over what I'm saying, put it in the comments. Um, because, like I said, I want you guys. Wait. Did Manny move again?
with that. <laughs> oh, darn it. So I'm dying to have that on my teeth. Um. Oh. And the reason, I think the reason I was wearing gray today is probably for a Lillian Munster look. And I noticed sometimes she would put her, her hair behind her ear when she was in a mood. She would do this. Or she would put her hair like this. I don't know if you guys ever noticed that. If she was in a mood, she'd put her hair like this. That's a grandpa and Herman. You knew something was not right for your day. Because she was coming after you. <laughs> oh my gosh. You guys ever noticed that? But, um, anyway, um... This keeps coming off on my teeth. I'm not really going to recommend, you know, like anything that comes off on your teeth. But um, I will do a wear test after the 31 looks of Halloween are over. And we already know this doesn't wear all day. I will test this and see how long this wears by itself um, after the 31 looks. So, um, my tribute to Lillian. Because last year I did Morticia. And Lily needs some recognition. She's too beautiful to leave out. So anyway guys, like I said, uh, look for the weird things. The only thing that does not count is the video. Those EVPs that I brought to you do not count as something weird. Unless you had seen something move in the background, then that counts as something weird. Like if you saw a shadow person, excuse me, or if you had seen something like just strange. But other than that, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed. And we will scare up some more fun. And no, I didn't uh, find my flash drive yet. We will scare up some more fun tomorrow.